Hey guys, this is Woody, and I'm here with the lovely Jackie, who some say has the power to stop a train in its tracks and make cars go vroom. That is an amazing intro. <laughs> Does it have anything to do with my new superpowers? Oh, you're talking about Lego? Yes. <laughs> oh my gosh. You get so addicted to the new Lego releases. You are I already... I have no idea what you're talking the about. The house completely falls apart as soon as a Lego game comes out. I, again, don't know what you're talking you about. Do, you're you do. I walk downstairs and the dog has chewed up like a soccer ball or something. And there is a bowl and a spoon in the middle of the living room floor. I don't know what you're talking about. Of course you He's don't. He's been chewing on that soccer ball for a while now. <laughs> he drags out all his toys from his cage. Oh my gosh. Like it, I had fast food for lunch today. You have fast food more than <laughs> once. Don't even I, act like oh, it. it. It's the but whole I will house say, falls You're slightly apart. right because I'm sitting here going, oh my God, oh my God, I need to get back to my game. You know, make sure this is a short one. She Yeah, she was asking me for <laughs> short gameplay. She wants like a one in the chamber match. So the white ones, they could be two and a half minutes long and she'll get back downstairs. Well, well what happened was I'm playing with Colin mm -hmm. and we play together. He's Robin, I'm Batman. And I know there's other characters in the game. And so we just got it yesterday. I haven't played that much. And I finally got to be Superman. And I am so excited. She is so excited. Like, be <laughs> I can hardly explain, like, the genuine excitement that exists in her. She got Superman. And Hope came up here and told me about it. She, she witnessed you unlocking Superman. And she's like, oh, Mom was so happy. She was so excited. And then Colin said... Can I be Superman too? <laughs> but you can't be two, right? Only one of them can be Superman yes. at a time. And Jackie, if she was really Superman, she would have killed him with her death ray guys. She she shot him a glare. I didn't shoot him a glare. I was just like, no, the mom in me was like, oh, I should really let him be Superman. But the Lego addict in me was just like, no, I'm Superman. I've been waiting to be Superman for so long. And he did get to play Superman. It goes back and forth. Uh-huh. But... I don't know who else I get to open. Like, I really want to open up Wonder Woman. And I don't oh, know if I get to be Wonder Woman. Wonder Woman is lame. I, like, I don't get this. What are Wonder Woman's superpowers? Right? She has, she has a stupid lasso that makes people tell the truth. Yeah, yeah, but that's not what the lasso does. She, she gets to swing with the lasso or something Bulletproof like bracelets. She does have which, bulletproof powers. Dude, this is a mostly naked woman with bulletproof bracelets. Y yes. An invisible jet. I don't think she has the jet. I in, think in she flies game. in this game. I think she has to fly in this game. Really? Because if you look on Wikipedia, she has some flying powers. Depending on where you look at the comic book. Flying isn't even a good superpower. People think flying is awesome. In Lego it is. Well, in real life. Because people think flying stuff. is this amazing superpower. Like, think of all the chicks I could score with flying and this and that. But in... Flying solves a problem I don't have, right? A transportation problem. Mm -hmm. You in, see, you're talking about something that I'm like, let's get back to the game. <laughs> <laughs> Flying solves a transportation problem. And I assume I'm still very cold and it's chilly as I zoom through the air. <laughs> I think I'd rather fly on a plane. I think I'd rather be in coach than to fly myself over to L.A. I think you're crazy. I don't think you're, you feel really? the cold. You're, what if you're I Superman. Offered... You don't have feel no, those but, types uh, of Superman, things. Superman, maybe. Wonder Woman's cheap, right? She doesn't <laughs> have crap. So, it, like, she's just oh, going to be all... Pa it, it's a lot like taking a flying motorcycle over to L.A., that's not even comfy. That's not a pleasant ride. <laughs> I think you're crazy. It's a bit of an adventure, but maybe one time. Let's get back to the game. The <laughs> game has talking in it, and, and Hope pointed out to me, that, again, this is probably the first time the characters have these little cutscenes where they're talking, mm -hmm. and it's really cool. And some of it has, they make references to the Arkham City game, which is really cool, But and I get. And, and some of it is this rival between Batman and Superman, which I had no idea about. So I really enjoy, I'm enjoying the cutscenes and some of these little hidden things that I get. Um, and then there's this driving. You have to drive from point to point, and and it's and you have to use the two sticks. And you know me. With both <laughs> I know what this means. It means you're going to be handing the controller to me. No, you have saying, to drive from point to point. So nobody's chasing you or anything like that. Okay. And and it is bad. If you're watching us, we're banging into things. Colin's oh. stuck in a wall. I went downstairs to throw something away, and you're like, don't watch, don't watch. It's painful. Like, it was a warning. No, yeah, it is. We were <laughs> trying to do something, and it was painful to watch. I'm like, it's not fun to watch us try to, like, get something on target. Because you have to, like, do stuff on target together. He's better than I am. I was going to say that. that he see, really is. You appear surprised by that. No, I'm not surprised. I'm not surprised I at all. I am ashamed by this. <laughs> I've been playing Lego 
for so long and he's so much better at it than I am. For people that don't know, Jackie actually is a gamer. Um, she usually likes games that like, I consider them games that are more about fun than challenge, right? She enjoys the Lego games. She enjoys Death Spank. She enjoys games that just about anyone can succeed in, but the experience is fun to live through. Like that's, that's your thing you in a game. just said anyone can succeed in? Lego. Well, I know, but come on. Could you say, like, you know, not everybody can succeed in? Okay. Who couldn't succeed in Lego? <laughs> She's laughing here. She's oh. <laughs> she prefers games that are more it. about the experience. Like, like I, I play Call of, Call of Duty is my only, like, competitive game. Like, something where you have to actually like develop some sort games. of skill. Yeah, that's not her thing. But um, uh, aside from Call of Duty, I also enjoy... Get like, you know, Borderlands or Minecraft lately. Or... I don't like a swarm of things coming at me mm -hmm. where I have to shoot them all up. Yeah, a lot of your, like, platformers and stuff are kind of like that. There's yeah, a, I like a... to run around and find things and mix things up and make something, like, but those yeah. kind of games. And then Any... you beat a few bad guys and continue. <laughs> anyway, because she's never played these what I'll consider competitive games, you know, ones that really require you to step up your, like, stick skill... She's just never developed any. I have never, no, no. <laughs> but, but what's that game um, where you thought it would be great for me? Ratchet Uncharted. and Clank? Uncharted. Oh, Uncharted. Yeah, yeah, because it's single. Pl well, it has multiplayer, but the single part but of it. But I could never get it. You actually liked watching Uncharted. Yes. It was like a movie that you couldn't wait to finish. Like, I would sit yeah. there and play, and we would watch it together. Yes, yes. Yeah. But this was now. I couldn't do it. Yeah. You know, I often get hazed about not being a real gamer. Oh, Woody, you're a COD gamer. You've never tried anything but COD. That's not true. No, because you did those little ninjas for me. Oh, my God. What game was that? It's called Little Ninjas. Little Ninjas? Yeah. Uh, and you have to go around. You have to pick up little things and stuff like that. But there was that one part where you part. had to sled and hit it just right, and that was almost virtually impossible. But it, No, but like I, I don't know. Like As I look back at like all the sort of major titles that like have had an impact on gaming, like I you, usually have played through them. You've played, yeah, lots yeah. of them. People think that the only games I play are the ones I post, but uh, I post the games. One thing about COD that fits so well, I'm getting off topic here, but it falls between like 4 and 12-minute games. Yeah, we games. stopped playing there's Lego. stop and start points in these 12-minute well, games, which make it Well, this time there are stop and stop points in Lego. Okay, but you have like a little save point. There's no way I'm posting Lego on my I channel. I know you're not posting we Lego. We posted it one time for like a Wife Wednesday because everyone asked for it. Show us Lego, show us Lego. It was boring. And then they saw it and they're like, oh my God, this is oh, so boring. This would be... I think they would turn off if they saw me and Colin driving around trying to get to our next <laughs> checkpoint. Dislike, unsub. Oh God, it was so... It's so, so, so bad. It really is. He's stuck in a wall, like a glitch point wall, mm -hmm. and I have to go and help him get out of the wall. So anyway, right now you are completely addicted to this game to the point that you're ignoring but all your other maternal I, responsibilities. I have to pack and and do lots of things and get ready. We're for, both going on trips. Yeah, so I have all these things to do, but my game is calling me. <laughs> I think everyone here can relate to that. And I'm like, wait, I, I think I need an Xbox for my room. Why does Call of Duty release at a time in which people have homework? I don't know. What kind of crap is that? Why does Lego release when I have places to go and things to do and cooking and cleaning? I hear you. Maybe it should come with some kind of services like homework services. Really? How often would that be? Like you enter one of those 16 digit codes in, yes. in, in, in your Xbox and some dude shows up and does your algebra? Exactly. That would be Someone comes and cooks and cleans. <laughs> like, oh, you need like three days to go through the whole game? Okay, I'll take care of everything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You, you like George Foreman chicken? Yeah, there you go. <laughs> but so, and then... I, I, dude, I'm getting a business idea here. A business dude, model. Dude, I'm good at math. I could totally just like... Oh, I'm sure you parents know, would love you. Next time COD comes out, I'll be like, what you got, dude? Quadratic equations? Give me. <laughs> <laughs> Give me. I'll get your homework done. And uh, and you go play COD. Don't you think we're supposed to like just take it in small bites and, and try to like resist the urge to play? Outsource that crap, man. <laughs> Outsource it. Right? Hire some guy, you know, like a what, paper on the Civil War? I was there. Well, I got this. Cereal for dinner tonight? <laughs> That's, you're not getting the service. Who would hire a cereal for dinner service? I'm just saying that's what's for dinner tonight. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> this sucks. I hate Lego Batman. No, but I, this might be one of the best. And then I heard Lord of the Rings was coming out after. So, so she pre-ordered immediately. Yeah, I did pre-order immediately. I, I can't wait. I don't even know. <laughs> like that, I can play as the guy with the 
The bow and arrow. Who's Legolas? Legolas? Yeah. Something like that? Uh, yeah. I mean, I don't think I want to be. Like, I hope they give the really dwarf like... proper respect. He didn't get the respect in the movie he deserved. I do you want read to be the book, him. If you read the book, the dwarf is quite the badass. And you know that scene at uh, Two Towers, I think, where they like fight for who killed more people? Yeah. The dwarf kicked his butt. At one point, the dwarf fell in like a crowd and they all thought he was dead. And then he comes back looking slightly tired with like a number, like 170 killed. Oh, uh, I, I, well, I didn't read the book, but I, I just don't know if I want to play as Frodo. Like, what's he going to do? I don't know. Precious. <laughs> I wonder what it's like to have his feet. We'll ask FPS Russia. He's got Frodo feet. He does? He does. I've never giant, met him in hairy person. Feet. Oh, they're, I have never met him in person. They're not even human feet. He just has like hobbit feet attached on a perfectly normal person. He has toe hairs <laughs> that picture. you could braid. Take a picture. I should do that next time. Well, it's the end of the, the show and I get to go back to Lego Batman. All right. That was Wife Wednesday. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Bye-bye and cereal for dinner. <laughs> All right. If you enjoyed this video, please click like. I always appreciate it when you guys do that and so does Jackie. Um, two videos you may have missed. The top one is the Xbox Update Explain. The new patch came out for it today and I usually cover those things. And the bottom one is Tactical Tuesday. It's a weekly series where I take a look at one of my gameplays and break down what went well and what went poorly. Sort of freeze frame it, talk about it. I think you might like it. Have a good day.